All right, next up, we've got uh, Oklahoma State, Houston, staying in the Big 12. Uh, Oklahoma State, seven-point road favorites, 59.5 being the uh, total in this game. Now, I knew that was a tricky spot for Oklahoma State off the, off the big rivalry win in Bedlam against Oklahoma, but I didn't think they would be that. Like, that was a no-show. That wasn't just we played bad. That wasn't just we were hung over. They didn't show up. They did not show up for that yeah, game at all. they got ripped in the bounce State house. Um, they, sh they should be better here. Um, but I've also – I remember a, an Oklahoma State season where they won Bedlam and they kind of no-showed after that, and then they kind of no-showed again. You know, so does this become another – is this another no show? Like if Oklahoma State shows up, they're better than Houston. They're significantly better than Houston. They can probably win this game by at least a touchdown. But I've got, I don't know, that that, that, that did not leave a good feeling in, in my stomach watching the way Oklahoma State just laid down, just was that didn't even, they didn't have their heads in the game. They didn't have their hearts in the game. Uh, they ended up losing 45-3 last week. Uh, it was the defense was bad, the offense. And again, that's just eight. Didn't show up there in that game. Uh, all kinds of issues. It was a horrible game for Alan Bowman. His worst by far, three interceptions uh, for him in that game. Um, this is probably a pass for me. I don't. I don't know if I want to trust Oklahoma State, but I know I don't want Houston. Houston is just nope. Not that coach. Not that guy. Dana Holgerson. Do I want my money on his team? A team coached by that guy. Uh, it's just not going to happen uh, at this point. What do you think here, Connor? Oklahoma State, Houston. Yeah, it seems like Oklahoma State's going to bounce back. And play better. I don't want them. That's for sure. Now, do I want Houston here like you just talked about with this team? Not really. But I think this game could be close. One thing, Oklahoma State, you know, has gotten a little bit better as the year, but they've kind of gotten into shootouts and they got their ass whipped last week. Uh, I think Houston could move the ball on them. This defense, Joe, just hasn't been great all year long. Um I don't know if I take Houston, though. No, I'm leaning that way. I think you got look at the over here. Yeah. Again, I think you, especially if it's at least under 60, you take the over. It's not like Houston's defense is very good. We just saw them give no. up 24 to Cincinnati, 41 to K-State. I mean, they've just been bad all year pretty much on the defensive side of the football. So maybe you can play it over. Uh, Donovan Smith, he's got to stay away from the interceptions, though. He had three of them last week against uh, Cincinnati uh, in that loss.